Today we travel to Denver, Colorado, and we're granted permission to explore the Grant Humphreys Mansion. This 15,000 square foot mansion was built in 1902 in the neoclassical style by architects Bull and Harnwall for James Benton Grant, following his one term as the third governor of Colorado, which was between 1883 and 1885. We were granted only a limited time to explore this mansion before a big wedding. So, let's just dive in and take a look around to see what the inside of this four-story mansion has to offer. This is so cool. So y'all just got done doing an event here? Or? Uh, we got like a wedding later today. Oh, wow. This, so that's the, oh, that's the guy. Um, yeah, so this is James Fenton Grant. He was, he was the third governor of Colorado. He was, uh, so he built this. This is his retirement home, um, but he started building this in 1883, uh, put a hold on it for like 20 years while they waited for the price of silver to recover, uh, finished it in 1902, and then he lived here uh, until 1911 before he passed away. His widow, Mrs. Mary Grant, sold the house to uh, Mr. A. Humphreys, who's the guy in the library here. He shot himself here in May 8, 1927 rather than testify before a grand jury uh, due to his involvement in the Teapot Dome scandal. So he's been said to haunt the house. So we're like a National Historic Landmark. Oh, and, uh, wow. Yeah. And then like his son is also the guy who invented the fishing reel, oddly enough. Like, really? Yeah, yeah. Holy his son is Ira Boyd Humphreys. And, cool. I'm a sucker for like the craftsmanship. Oh yeah, man. Like all the like all the detail, the molding, like wow. the old carriage house in the back there. That used to be like the servant's house and carriage house back in the day. Any yeah. secret rooms? Uh, no, there's like, there's a tunnel that runs underneath the, uh, the, the, uh, back terrace there. Like, there's a little carriage house. Uh, that was installed during 1917 during World War One as a garage tunnel. Wow. Dang. This is so cool. Yeah, this whole area, you see from the floor, you back in the day, you can see This is plastered, correct? Yeah. All handmade plastered? Oh, yeah. Golly. And you can see, like, uh, the skylights back here, uh. Did they do, uh, funerals here, too? Um. You know, we do memorial services occasionally. We don't do like. Be, I mean, but, but back then, this uh, is why it was designed, right? Well, probably this probably uh, you know it was pretty common for like Victorian Edwardian folks to actually like do funerals in their home. Right, right, right. Yeah, so it wouldn't surprise me if they they had it like in the main reception room there. Okay, it's, I know it's weird, but back then like they they used to do them at their homes mm -hmm. and stuff instead of an actual building. Yeah, they'd so have weird. them in like there for a couple days. Like, <laughs> go ahead and take a look. I'll I'll let you guys. Shoot, so man. when you get to the bottom of the stairs, take a left and immediate left, and the men's rooms in there. Okay. It's actually really cool so just like, like i know it sounds weird but like yeah yeah <laughs> thank you yeah. thank you wow all right let's check this out this is so cool we actually were able to get in here and uh wow so they use this as a uh wedding venue they do a lot of the uh just events and weddings here super cool i mean look at these pillars this nice little stage here. Very cool. I think you can get in here. Wow. Okay, so he said hang a left and hang a left. So he said the men's room is pretty cool. The, what? Yes, this is the, the, the guys that oh, was it wow. the other guy that committed Yeah. Space? Oh wow. Look at the save guys. It's pretty cool. Alright, let's go check this bathroom because the guy said I needed to check it out. It's really cool. So wow. Oh my gosh. Man, it just got it's got this mildew smell to it. I don't know if you guys can see it that well, but to the left, wait, is this, um, oh. Really cool. <laughs> What's up, guys? Wow, pretty neat. All that stone work. Because we just came down that way. And here's the stairs. This is the elevator. Another part of, like, so I guess they host some really big vents here. Some huge events. 
Is it going on? Yeah. What? Look at this. Oh, this used to be a bowling alley. No way, guys. This used to be a freaking bowling alley. I'm almost positive that's what this is. This used to be a bowling alley, guys. No way. Please tell me. Where this is where the pins would be. It's got a bowling alley. This, look at that. That's so cool. Wow. How cool is that? Wow. That is so cool. So what was the, what was the basement? Uh, I don't know. Um, was it this? Was it the middle It's locked, so I can't go in there. I think this is the basement, babe. <laughs> it's so cool. Like, like where this painted over the wallpaper or something. Oh, this is the servant's staircase. Oh, let me get the, let me get this. Okay. Downstairs first. So this is got like the kitchen. Wow. Oh, this is so cool. They put all their stuff here. Look at this, guys. Very cool. Is that the freezer? Old school freezer. Look at this old school freezer, guys. That is so cool. Wow. That is really cool. What do you think? It's pretty neat. Wow. Guys, this is really cool. We got lucky on this one. So you pass the food through here? Looks like original, original stuff, yeah. Mm -hmm. I mean, of course, it looks like it's a lot of it's been updated, but probably kept to its original self. <laughs> Dude, is there a bowling alley downstairs that used to be that a bowling? Used to be a bowling alley. I yeah. knew it. Oh my yeah. gosh! They ripped that out in 1917, turned that into a shooting range. <laughs> oh my gosh! A shooting range? Uh -huh. Oh my gosh! So let's go upstairs and let's see what is up here. Look at this stained glass. It's an old wood floor. It's a bridal suite. Yeah. The bridal so, suite? Yeah, this used to be uh, Mrs. Grant's master bedroom. Oh, wow. Because they used to sleep separately back in the day. <laughs> the first place they actually showed two people in the same bed on TV. <laughs> yeah. Wow. Yeah, the 1920s time. Like, gosh. Look at this sink. All porcelain, not porcelain, it's cast iron. Burn up to hurt real bad. <laughs> yeah. Wow, this is really cool. Yeah. And this used to be uh, the master guest, like the master bedroom in the winter. So she'd sleep in here because she'd get the southern sunlight and the fireplace. Right. This used to be the guest room. Really? Otherwise, yeah. Oh, wow. But, like, oh, this room's bigger than that room. <laughs> <laughs> One of my favorite pieces in here is actually a bedside buzzer to like call the butler oh. so you didn't have to get out of bed to like summon them. Oh. <laughs> wow. Dang. And what is that? Crawl space or what? Uh, this is just access to pipes. Oh. Oh, okay. Oh, wow. <laughs> Interesting. This is really cool. They had a ton of built-ins. It's really pretty. Oh, and you can see Pikes Peak real well to the south today. Oh, wow. So that's 70 miles. Uh, Dang. As the crow flies. Wow. Right out there. I don't know if you guys can see that. Oh, yeah. yeah, that's in the library downstairs. Wow. Very interesting. Uh, and like one of my favorite little tidbits is like so this building right here is actually where that apartment complex is outside. Mm -hmm. And that was the governor's house while he was the governor of Colorado. So James was living there at the time and he uh, built this place less than a, like half a block away and moved into his retirement home yeah. to another mansion. <laughs> <laughs> Very neat. Can you imagine the butler and their service coming up here with the food and whatever drinks? Dang! Holy crap! 
other side is the Bruin side. And across the street from us, that old red brick building used to be the former French consulate. A lot of stuff happened over here. Oh yeah, I'm like, this is a happening place back in the day. Wow. Like the former um, Denver Archdiocese and Archbishop used to live in the Malo Mansion on the corner. Wow. What's, what's back here? Uh, so this used to be a little butt, like this would be the... Uh, the servants' corridor. The butler lived in this room. It's actually, uh, like, we're transitioning it into a uh, game room eventually. Um, oh, we're getting exclusive access right here. Yeah. But yeah, so like this used to be his room back in the day. Just, wow. Like, or something. This is a nice size. Yeah. Dang. Oh yeah, way People better live. than the nanny like upstairs. She she got one window. Like, oh um, my gosh. She still <laughs> wants the place. Like, really? Oh yeah, dude. She's pissed. Oh wow, another bathroom. Yeah. Everything's it's got a weird tiled ceiling. Like, <laughs> yeah. Wow. Which, you know, it's weird if you put tile on a ceiling, it just gives it like an asylum feel instantly. Or it like does. a you know, slaughterhouse. Yes. Or something. You're going to need to hose it down. Yeah, like, especially yeah. the green the green tile. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Look at that little window, guys. <laughs> <laughs> Look at that old uh, shower head. <laughs> That's really cool. Right, so, like so is the upstairs off limits? Yeah, third floor is staff only, unfortunately. Okay, no worries. Yeah. So what was the what was the main purpose up there? I mean, what... so third floor used to be uh, A. Humphrey's old gun room. It was okay. the nursery, the nanny's room, and the nanny's sitting room. Oh wow. Um. So yeah, it's. Uh, so this like, is what three floors? Yeah. Four wow. total. Oh, four so, total. What's the Where's the fourth? Uh. So counting the basement. Oh, what? I thought we just came from the basement. Uh, the the bullion? Yeah, so the bullion alley yeah. is the basement. Yep. Okay. One, okay. two, oh, three. Yeah. yeah. But you almost think the bullion alley kind of goes with that same room. <laughs> yeah, the bar. The bar, yeah. Yeah. This place is massive. Yeah. So like, back there, there's like a tunnel that runs all the way through. Oh wow. So this is the tunnel guys that comes all the way through into the building so that the servants wouldn't be seen by the guest. <laughs> Crazy stuff. This is cool and this is the carriage house. Yeah, this is the carriage house. You can see like how much it opens up down here too. Yep. Yeah. Yeah, so oh there's, like, wow. Okay. <laughs> yeah, like another like couple stories. <laughs> used to have like 15 cars back in the day in there like oh my gosh dude cool yeah thank you so much man oh yeah man appreciate it yeah a thank lot yeah. really really means a lot man thank you so yeah. much well, it's, it's cool like see people come in and get excited about this house oh, like you know because <laughs> like it, yeah. wow that is cool there's some things I want to point out, not to shout, it's a lot Sorry that was doubt on the cloud, trying to fill this out, trying to fill this out Paperwork, 